Hello everyone. Hope you're all doing great. Yo, you join me today over at Torwoodley, just next to the golf course here. Spied a uh, really interesting abandoned house just off the main road. Just a little cottage actually. Just there. So we're just going to go and have a little peek inside. Fancy coming? Come on then. Beautiful old oak trees lining this old ancient road here. Beautiful. Hello guys, so it's the next day. Failed getting there yesterday. It wasn't the place for the dogs, but I had a quick look inside, so it's worth going in and having a look. So I'm back on the bike today. We're we heading up there. So we'll be there in a sec. Nearly there. Okay guys, so we made it over now, just by Torwoodley Golf Course. Hit proper hidden away on the road. I imagine that this place would have been here when the, the Borders Railway was in operation and this road here wouldn't have been anywhere near as busy as it is these days. I imagine it would have been a small farmhouse. It looks like there's a, a stable to the uh, side of the house here, but let's go and have a look inside, shall we? Okay. So this looks like uh, some kind of work workstation. We've got a bench here, which looks like it would have had vices on it. These old hooks on the ceiling. Okay. Like a big giant uh, nest of some kind. Fireplace has been ripped off, been damaged. You see where it's been overboarded on the natural stone. That's the window. I haven't really got much of a view out, really. I imagine the chimney needs sweeping. Evidence of uh, beer cans, so it looks like some people have been using this as a place to chill. Ah, okay, this fireplace looks a bit more intact. Oh, the, f the, f the floor here is uh, really spongy. Must be a basement underneath. Uh, this house is infected with uh, with vines. An old newspaper there. Whether you can uh, make that out. And with the spiders. The newspaper that must be quite old. Bits of the uh, upstairs flooring coming in. That, uh, those glazed tiles are nice. Oi! Oh no, nearly went, nearly went down the cellar there, guys. Okay, so this would have been the main front door here. It's all rotten and falling away. Ah, <laughs> the staircase, complete with its own vine. Okay, sh shall we try and attempt to go up here? Yes, it'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? Oh, it's it's going to be a bit tricky here, guys, because I want to make sure that if this staircase does collapse, that I've got a good handle on the railings here. Okay, I can feel them moving. This is why you should leave exploring these kind of places to crazy people like myself ah oh, nice 
Uh, there's a bed, there's a bed, there's a bed guys. And the ceiling feels like it's gonna come in. And there's a bit of a camp bed there. Somebody has been sleeping homeless here. They've been using this place as a home. But man, look at the, look at the vines coming through the window. Jeez, Louise. Man, I've never seen anything like it. And uh, the old uh, steel bath with um, a toilet. And then a massive hole. And uh, The sink's been ripped out. And here's the other bedroom here. So it's got two bedrooms. It would have just been like a little small farm holding. Probably had a bit of land at the back. Oh, I risk walking across this floor. Yeah, probably would have had a bit of land at the back. Kept a few cows or horses or something. And this would have gone straight into his workshop again. Oh my god. Now I'm not going to try and make it across there because that would be foolish. Lovely stone walls of these Scottish houses. The walls are about four foot thick. And, uh, I'm not going to go up, but I'll uh, lift the camera up and uh, see if you guys can see anything. See anything? Wow, look at all those butterflies. Uh, this is where butterflies come to uh, to hibernate. Loads of them with uh, moths. That's the stairs of doom. Right, I'm gonna go back down and turn you off a sec. Yeah, so in his workshop again. I don't wanna say his workshop. I never met the guy. <sighs> this is strange. It's like a a big uh, cavern in the wall here. There's like a stone that's blocking it up. You can feel here, you feel like a draft, so there must be something behind that. That's going up through the through the ceiling. So we're coming up through the garden now. Absolutely overgrown. A, ah, a barn owl. Sorry dude, did I uh did I just startle you? Yeah? It's a big cauldron. Possibly could be a witch's cauldron. Here looks like a kennel for a dog. Ah! Whoa! Oh, I've just got dive bombed by another barn owl. Whoa. Okay, so uh, that's it from me on this busy main road here in the Scottish borders. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe, do all the good stuff. And I'll see you on the next one, yeah? So, on the road again. Seeing places I've never seen again. Everybody on the road again. Right, Scott's house.